Teresa Vick noticed something very strange this morning. I just delivered the Tulsa World in this area, and I was throwing a newspaper here at the community center and just happened to come upon him with the jar already on his head about 5.30 this morning. This hungry skunk was just looking for a meal when he got his head caught in a peanut butter jar. Teresa called several places before she found Ned Bruja, the skunk whisperer. She kept the skunk corralled as she waited for Ned. I stopped, and I just stood next to him, and he kept running into my feet and, and didn't spray me or anything, just as sweet as can be. All wildlife wants is food, water, and shelter. Peanut butter is irresistible to this skunk. They are opportunistic, and they're going to take advantage of any bit of food they can get. This guy found peanut butter, and he got himself in a little bit of trouble. I'm going to see if I can help him out here. Ned used a rag soaked in chloroform to mildly sedate the skunk before attempting to pull the jar off his head, hopefully without getting sprayed. I'm hearing people say, I've seen this on America's Funniest Home Videos. I don't want to be on America's Funniest Home Videos. I don't want to get sprayed today. I've never been sprayed, handled tons of skunks, but I don't care to get sprayed. You're all right. Here you go. Say thank you. I was very excited, and I was <laughs> jumping for joy inside because uh, I'm just glad that he's okay now. The skunk just seemed happy to be free once more. Chris Howell, NewsOn6.com.